Hi everyone and welcome to a Mighty Ginkgo tutorial. My name is Zero and I'll be your instructor for these lessons. Kind of forgot what I used to say. It's been so while. Okay, so we're going to do something a little different today and we're going to be installing Soft Image, uh, the Autodesk Soft Image. So when you get the file, it should have the ISO in here. Now it's totally okay to install this because Soft Image has been discontinued by Autodesk. So it's okay for us to share stuff for once. <laughs> okay, so once you download it, put it in a folder or whatever, and you're going to get the ISO. Now you're going to need Damien tools or any kind of ISO, uh, what you call it, mounting software for this. And uh, you just, once you get that installed, you just double click on it and load it up. It'll say mount an image. I'm using a Damien light. And once you get it, you're just going to open the folders here. Give it a second. Sometimes my computer likes to do it, sometimes it doesn't. So I'm just going to manually go in there. So when you open up the folder, um, you're going to look into the part where it says crack. I'm going to open it and you're going to open the text file and it's going to tell you what to do. So what we're going to do is follow this uh, list here and just install from there. So let's start with the very first thing. Okay, it went up to the toolbar. Can't get it. Okay, here we go. So what we're going to do is we're going to first install it, register it, and do whatever else this list says. So let's start at the top. Install the program. <laughs> so we're going to go back to the navigation folder and we're going to hit this button here that says set up. Say yes. Wait for it to do its thing. And you want to hit install. Agree. Next. And then when it asks you the license type. You're going to just press, I guess standalone is fine. And then you want to press, I have a product information slash serial number. So we got the serial number. We're going to go back to that folder that says uh, install. And we're just going to copy the first half and uh, copy the second half. Yay! And then we're going to scroll down and you're going to copy the product key. Yay! And then once you get check checks, we're going to hit next and go on installment. So everything is already checked by default, so we're just going to do that. And then hit install and wait for it to install. So this is going to take a minute. So the progress bar. So rather than sitting here chatting with me, I'm just going to pause it real quick and then come back once it's done installing. Okay, that took all but five minutes. So everything is installed. So we're just going to hit finish. And installation. And that's going to restart the product. So, oh, soft image chooser. Uh, uh, this is new. And I'll tell you which one. Finish and restart. Uh, application, right? Soft image. Mod oh, okay. This one. I had the other thing, the mod tool installed too. So I'm just going to click that. Mm -hmm. Alright, so I'm off. Mm -hmm. Alright, there we go. Hopefully, this is it. Any second now. Alright, there we go. Alright, yay. I agree to use. Wait. <sighs> well, I guess you had to agree. I agree. Okay, so. Before clicking activate, you have two options disable your network card and pull the network cable out and block it with a firewall. This is just to disable the online serial check. B, click on activate and it'll tell you that your serial is wrong. Simply click on close and click on activate again. Let's just block it with the firewall. So what I'm going to do is to go down to my network and I'm going to disable it. So give me a second. Don't want y'all hopping on my Wi-Fi around here. <laughs> okay, so I disabled my Wi-Fi. Okay, so we have that here. Uh, what did they say to do? Disable your Wi-Fi. Pull the network card out. I don't need it. Just turned it off. 
uh, and then block it with my firewall or block it with your firewall hmm so this is just turning your internet off and doing it will work so let's say activate Oh, I broke it. Oh, I have to scroll down. <laughs> All right, so um, turn the internet off, choose down, scroll down, activation. Now we open up the keychain. So that would be the crack, and I have 64. Nice. <laughs> All right, so let's copy this again. Um, let's see, what do we do next? Let's uh, click on memory patch. All right to the current directory. Oh, because it's in there, you're gonna wanna use an admin mode. Yes. Paste request here. Mm, where'd it go? Request code. Control C. Come on. There you go. Let's delete everything. And we'll go to the request code, highlight it. Because you can't right click, you're going to press Control C. And then and delete everything. Right here, if there's nothing, it looks like it's a T there, right? No, oh, no, it's just a bracket. All right, so we're gonna press Control C to copy, Control V to paste it, and then generate, and then patch. Make sure you can write to the current directory. All right, so I guess what I see uh, the problem is, quit. We have to go navigate to where we installed the set always a fun so let's see where is it installed mm. open file location and let's see if this will help copy Paste it here. Continue. So delete that. Copy the request code again. Press Control C. Control V. Press Generate. And then try patch it. All right. Now why in the? I wonder if could. Oh. Okay. Let's see what the thing says. Yeah, so why in the blinking hay? Oh. Do we have to run it as an admin again, maybe? Okay, yes, okay. So you have to run it as an admin, put it in the file, and then it successfully patched. Okay? So then we copy your request code into the key and press. Uh, well, I guess that would have helped if I want to scroll down a little more. <laughs> Yeah, fully registered product. Make sure you're running it as an admin. Ah, yeah. All right, so copy the generated code. Request an activation code. Wait, wait, wait! I, I, I globbed up. I have an activation code. 
Yay! That's the it. <laughs> Alright, so then we hit finish and everything is should be done. No thanks. I don't want to send information to them, so just hit no. And though I love the music, I should turn it off. So this is soft image. I guess I give it a second to, to run. Alright, soft image. Now we can start making our fighting game stuff. So that's going to be another tutorial. Sorry it took so long, but I hope we had fun at least starting up. Now uh, let's get on to some more complex stuff like, you know, how to use it. That's going to be fun to, um, what's it called? I hate this chair. Sorry, it's all squeaky. Alright, so anyway, that's it for this tutorial. I'll see you guys in the next one, whatever it may be. And good luck out there. I think we can all make good fighting games, right? Yeah. <laughs>